The city of Tucson is working to fight their ongoing illegal dumping problem. Neighborhoods throughout the city continue to find abandoned trash and furniture in alleyways and other public spaces. Well, tonight, city officials and concerned residents gather to talk about how the city's codes could be better enforced. Nine Your Size, Jennifer Dela Cruz, attended that meeting. She joins us now with what is going to change. Jennifer. Well, one of the main concerns from residents tonight was that not only is illegal dumping aesthetically unpleasing, it's also a health and safety concern. The city of Mesa recently updated their code enforcement procedures, and they've seen a significant improvement in compliance. Tonight, they presented their new changes to figure out what needs to be done differently here in Tucson. Mesa code officials amped up their enforcement by decreasing the amount of time they waited until issuing violations and changing the way they handled the complaint process. By doing so, they found people reacted more quickly to the violation by cleaning up the trash or cutting overgrown weeds. Before then, those issues would sometimes go for months and even years without being addressed. Council member Steve Kazachik says Tucson's current policies don't get results fast enough. We have so much process built into what we do here locally that you never quite cross the finish line and hold the property owner or the property manager accountable. So what we need to do is we need to find a way to cut to the trace from go from zero to 60, say, look, this is your stuff. If it's not your stuff, you're responsible for the property. You need to clean it up or you're going to get fined. And, and that's where we need to get quickly. Mesa's doing it. We're not. Just this week, the city of Tucson agreed to start contracting inmates to help clean up some of the trash in our neighborhoods. Councilmember Kazachek says although that will help, the process to enforce the codes still needs some work. Residents said they also saw an increase in dumping of things like microwaves and couches around the U of A when students move out of their dorms. Mesa officials recommended starting a code enforcement task force and citing individuals who don't comply with city code. Stella. Jennifer, thank you.